ladies and gentlemen friends and viewers this is Tormi with the capital Z and today I just wanted to make a video about asking you something I wanted to do a let's play a walkthrough series over YouTube and this is something that I wanted to do since a very long time and I haven't really been very successful in doing it in the past so yeah I have a list of games which will be uh, listed in the which will be in this video that is it will uh, show a little a little part of the game and I'll be talking about what the game is about and all I want you guys to do is vote for it and like just let me know on what game do you think would go well and what game do you specifically want to see so just comment below as it it'll be considered as a vote nothing is really a, nothing much else that is uh, everything will be coming on this channel that is youtube.com that slash the funky cast this is a channel which has been started by a few people including myself who met on TGN strategy and without further ado let's get on to the list of games all right we're on with game number two this is commanders 2 men of courage this game is one of the most awesome games I have ever played it revolves around the World War 2 it runs on the World War 2 the events of World War 2 that is and it's based on you play you play as the English you are on the English side and you are put into certain stealth machine stealth missions you need to go inside the Nazi encampments their bases steal their weaponry sometimes destroy their fuel tanks and the game is have has a lot of depth in itself because it's not like a, it's not like your normal strategy games where you have a number of soldiers you fight with them and you send them to your enemy there are a lot of things that your soldiers can do they can duck they can crawl they can hide inside beds they can hop out of windows and this whole thing is there are like uh, there are like 50 uh, 50 different ways to complete every mission that's all i can say about this this is one of the most awesome games i've played and probably the most awesome game in the whole real-time tactics genre so yeah if you guys allow me I would really really be happy to do this game so yeah and that is really about this one let's get on to the second game alright getting on to the next game this is Fire Emblem a real-time strategy game released for the Game Boy Advance yes Game Boy Advance it later on came to the other consoles but I don't think it, there was a PC version for it this is one of the best well one of the best turn based real-time strategies I played so far the whole the whole plot is around what kind of units you use what kind of weapon you use and the combat go something like this and they they really aren't really limited to only and only leveling up of your characters because they are, they they also have some skill points over the weapon so the more you use the weapons the more damage they do next time and all that you also meet up new characters while you well the story goes on and all that stuff you go by dungeons and there's really a lot to it it has a really really good story and I would definitely definitely be glad to do this game that is before every mission you also have this preparatory screen where you get to select from all of the characters you have there are a lot of classes in this a lot of different weapons that they each class can use each weapon each uh, weapon you're holding has a weakness and uh, they also have a something that they are good against which they can crit against and all that stuff so it's a really good game just let me know below in the comments below that is okay the next game that I would want to be doing it would be Pokemon Pokemon I would pick any of them Fire Red Green game obviously that would be on your vote as well if you pick this game that is it, is, it may be one of the most overdone let's plays on YouTube but people are still watching it the main reason because there are like a there are like thousands of different ways to finish this there you can have thousands of different combinations you can do you can do nuzlocke moves you can do an evolution runs and I'm actually kinda keen on doing one of them rather than doing a normal let's play like many people do so yeah if you guys want me to do this let me know in the comments below yeah. Alright, the next game that I would want to do a let's play over will be the Age of Empires Conqueror Expansion. Why? Just because this game is one of the best RTS games I've ever played. 
even despite of all these years, I mean, I still have this game on my PC. I've still played it too many times, and I don't know. I just want to do this before it comes too late to make a like a video on these. Oh, and yeah, Age of Empires, Age of Empires you can Online also build does fail. To defend your city. Units can garrison within a tower for defense and protection, and archers can even fire out of a tower. Okay, this is narrator ends. A little description about the game. This game is a real-time strategy game based the 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 thing about this game is that it has many many races, but the all the unit all of the units of the races are same. The races are separated and balanced by each other by uh the only thing okay okay <laughs> about the balance the only thing that balances the game over there is some upgrades are available to some races and some way some upgrades are not and the only thing which is actually separate actually different in each race is a unique unit which is probably most of the time from created from the castle that is so yeah build a castle you must first advance to the next age uh, yeah the castle age yeah 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 okay yeah all right the next game that i would like to do would be robin hood legends of sherwood now this game might not seem as awesome well it's not really it's not really as good as compared to Commander 2, but it, it it is a medieval Commander 2. That's all I can say about it. It's really it's really it's a really good game as well. But it's all it's more about using weapons such as the arrow and strat it's also stealth oriented like commando, so yeah. Your mission is about using these arrows, using going to the enemies, fighting with swords and Finishing your missions and over here most of your missions are like uh, going and saving somebody and most of them were like saving somebody I guess so yeah and giving to the poor who actually gives us a hint so yeah this game is also good I would really like to do this one as well just let me know in the comments below and I guess this would be the last in the series, uh, last in, last option that is, and whichever game you would like me to do, just comment below, and I guess that is pretty much about it. So yeah, after seeing all those games, I am pretty sure you could decide on what I should be doing, what would be best for me, or what you would like, what you would obviously want me to cast and all that. Well. Apart from that, if you guys might know that there are some custom campaigns in Warcraft 3 as well, so I I don't know, I wouldn't say they are the best things ever, I don't know if they are even worth casting, but in case you guys would even like to see them, I would be very much happy to cast them out on this channel. So yeah, youtube.com slash the funky cast, go there, subscribe as, to them as well as they will also be having... Uh, this uh, channel is also be having some content, uh, which will be which a part of it, which would be mine as well. So yeah, that is pretty much about it. That's it. That's all. Z out.